Is the world ready for another pandemic? The question might seem alarmist, but it is one that health experts are asking themselves as we delve into the potential threat of a new strain of avian influenza, or bird flu. Recent developments have raised concerns about this potential threat. Traditionally, bird flu has been primarily an issue among poultry, with little implication for human health. However, recent findings indicate that the virus has made an unexpected leap to cattle. While the risk was initially downplayed, a new concern has emerged. Fragments of the avian flu virus have been discovered in pasteurized milk. According to the Food and Drug Administration, one in five samples of pasteurized milk from areas with infected dairy herds tested positive for these fragments. A significant portion of the American population consumes dairy products regularly. The potential for extensive exposure, should these virus fragments indicate a broader vulnerability, is stark. Health officials and experts assure us that pasteurized milk remains safe to drink, as the pasteurization process should theoretically neutralize any live virus. Bill Gates, among other prominent voices, has previously warned about the risks posed by highly infectious viruses and the potential for bioterrorism to exacerbate these threats. The current situation with the avian flu reflects some of these concerns, with mutations allowing the virus to infect new species suggesting a potential for further unexpected developments. Echoing sentiments from the outset of the COVID-19 pandemic, the former Surgeon General warns that the bird flu could adapt to infect humans any day, suggesting that vigilance and preparedness are paramount. The US Department of Agriculture has responded by mandating testing for bird flu in dairy cows before interstate transport. Meanwhile, individuals may consider their consumption choices carefully staying informed about the origins and safety practices of the dairy products they consume. While the risk from these virus fragments in milk is currently assessed as low, it serves as a reminder of the ever-present threat of infectious diseases. The possibility of another pandemic, whether from avian flu or another pathogen, remains a critical concern. It requires both public awareness and scientific inquiry to manage effectively. So remember to stay informed, stay vigilant, and most importantly, stay healthy. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more updates and insights.